that take you out. Look at somebody say, I know you've been crying because you look like tears. I know you've been worried because you look like worry. But I stop in tonight to tell you, don't let nothing take you out. Understand that when you understand that when you get the house of God and in the presence of God, there's a place in your spirit that you don't allow the enemy to get full control. You have to understand that the devil can't get you home sometime. And he tried to get you at church. All of a sudden you're wondering where the people is. All of a sudden your mind is focusing on other things other than what you need to hear from God. Look at your neighbor and say, neighbor, don't let nothing take you out. You have to understand that you got to come in and come in with everything you got. You have to understand that I need God and I just don't need him, but I need him right away. Look at your neighbor and say, neighbor, Oh! <laughs> 
and he understand that Saul he's now the Philistine is fighting against Israel and the men of Israel flee from the Philistine and fell upon the slave in Jehovah. Understand that Jehovah was a chain of mountains. And this chain of mountains in a territory area was called Issachar. And in that place it was the rising from the eastern edge. I have to understand that this mountain was all around him and here him back in the valley. Some of us are surrounded by mountains and my God you can't come out. And some of you trying to climb the mountains. But I heard God say, have a faith as great as a master say. And speak to your mountain. And the Bible said, yeah, move on your way. Tell him I ain't climbing no rough side of the mountain. I'm going to speak to it. And it's got ready to move on my way. Sickness is a mountain. Speak to it. It's got to move. Lying and conniving. No joy of our soul. Whatever it is, don't let it take you up. Find you somebody that don't let it take you up. He's he, they done kill his son Jonathan. Then uh -huh. I turn around and kill a baby dad. They done kill all of Saul's sons. And Saul got so scared and he reselling his armor bearers. And armor bearers, you better not be weak inside. He said, listen here, get them before they get me, before they abuse me. He no use of having folks around you that can't fight. He go, take them and say, neighbor.